Hello everyone, I am Dr. Rohan Khandelwal, the lead consultant and head breast surgeon at CK Birla Hospital, Gurgaon. In this video today, I will be talking about two very common terms with which patients come to us. One is known as fibroadenosis and the other one is fibroadenoma. Now the terms might seem alike, but the presentation and the treatment is very different for both of them. So a fibroadenoma is the most common cause of a breast lump and this is a non-cancerous breast lump which is also known as a breast mouse. Why a breast mouse? Because it keeps on moving inside the breast and that's what patients complain. They say that there's a lump which is moving inside the breast and this usually occurs between 15 to 35 years of age. Now a fibroadenoma can be diagnosed by clinical examination and by an ultrasound and only those patients where the fibroadenoma is increasing in size, where it is painful, where the size is more than 3 or 4 centimeters or there is a family history of cancer, only in those patients we recommend surgery. Otherwise other patients are just managed with routine scans and reassurance. And the surgery which we offer for fibroadenomas is called VAB, that is vacuum assisted breast surgery, which is a scarless method of removing these lesions. And it can be done on the daycare basis as well. The other condition which is very commonly seen in ultrasound reports and it starts bothering patients is fibroadenosis. Another name for fibroadenosis is fibrocystic disease and this is the most common cause of breast pain. And usually the pain which females get in fibroadenosis is a cyclical pain. What does that mean? That means that this pain is more before the periods and as the periods start the pain starts to reduce and it will gradually build up in the next cycle as well. This problem is also seen between 18 to 35 to 40 years of age and sometimes the pain can be so severe that it can warrant the need for a painkiller as well. Again the diagnosis of fibroadenosis can be made by clinical examination and an ultrasound and the patient can sometimes feel a lumpy breast. The treatment for fibroadenosis is lifestyle changes like weight reduction, reduction in the amount of caffeine which is being consumed, re reducing chocolate, salt and sugar intake and we also give vitamin E capsules. In addition to all this, I also recommend haldi water to my patients because it is anti-inflammatory. It has also been seen that fibroadenosis pain gets triggered whenever the patient is going through a stressful situation. So any kind of personal or professional stressor can trigger this pain as well. So if you are having a lump in the breast or if you are having breast pain, please do consult a breast surgeon as they can help you diagnose the correct condition and manage it accordingly. If you like the content of the video, please do press the like button and do subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. Thank you.